Redoing a tile floor can be pricey to say the least. So today we're gonna be talking tips for painting and stenciling your tile so it can go from this to this without breaking the bank. The first tip is to choose an area of tile to stencil that has low exposure to water. Places like bathtub or shower backsplash and countertops are not great because they do have a lot of exposure. However, this doesn't mean these areas are impossible to stencil. They will likely just require more touch-ups and will fade quicker. Secondly, let's talk paints. You can use chalk paint, latex paint, or oil-based paint. Chalk paint gives you a shabby chic look. It's great for creating an aged appearance and can also be distressed easily. Latex and oil-based paints are the best two to use in my opinion, mainly because they adhere to prime tile really well. The main difference is the cleanup process and oil-based paint is less prone to chipping, but it does take longer to dry when painting. Thirdly, stenciling tile can be time consuming. It is of course worth it to get these gorgeous looks, but do keep in mind that that room that you're stenciling may be out of commission for a few days, especially if you're stenciling by hand versus using a roller that will take longer. As long as you plan accordingly, especially for places like a bathroom, like having a secondary bathroom you can use, then you'll be good. Our next step is to clean your stencil throughout the stenciling process, especially if you're stenciling a large area. The paint will dry on your stencil, making it difficult to clean later and your design less crisp. This can be time consuming but it is really worth it for preserving your stencils for a lifetime of use. I would recommend cleaning your stencil every 10-ish tiles. You can do this by just running the stencil under water, letting it soak for a few minutes in the bathtub, or you can grab some paint remover if you've got some stubborn paint stuck to your stencil. All right, that is the end of our tile stenciling tips. If you have any questions that weren't covered in this video, feel free to ask us in the comments below. Head to our website to check out more of our stencils and don't forget to tag us on social media with your stencil art.